guys been here? You know, we just opened. Yeah. Grand, grand opening today, actually. Oh, wow. Such a coincidence. I just I know. happened to be here. You're so crazy. Got some T111 siding just so we could uh, finish out the exterior a little nicer. I'm gonna put some nice corner trim on. Got some old windows that we salvaged to go in still, but salvaged this door that they had on the property and got that in yesterday with a new knob. So the garden shed right now. Got a ways to go, some vents to go in on the ends, but uh, Probably one of the best views from a garden shed out there. Hey, I brought you a sip of some of Phil's coffee. Ooh, darn. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, hi. Hi, huh? Look at this is coming along. Yeah. yeah. Windows in. Windows need a little serious cleaning, but they're uh, <laughs> but they're in. Found materials. Yeah. What you got there, honey? I'm cocking. You got some cock? I got cock. Some cock for your cock gun? Cock for the crack. Cock for the crack. Cool. Nice tree right here. Billy's van. The park. We call this the park over here. And then fire pit area. Yeah, this is um really nice. Well, good morning. Got our final details to finish up here now on our little garden shed. Got the door in, got the windows in, got a bunch of the siding on, so now I just need to finish out some of the trim. Had these uh, corbel pieces that were left over from the uh, their new studio build that I uh, chopped down and cut in half and put here on the end of the uh, gable on the more visible side here. Right, so garden shed continues. We got a bunch of primer on, so it's ready for paint now. But is done got the tile into this first main shelf um, happened to have six of these tiles and uh, so used them up exactly to fill in in between here and kind of going right back into the space here so got to grout things up of uh, exterior paint and a uh, couple coats of primer on for the trim but uh, now we're gonna finish painting the exterior trim we are just about done here uh, some more final details putting on i got the uh some metal on the uh upper on the fascia here and then got that all painted up and looking spiffy and got some more trim paint on to finish things off looking real nice got purdy green paint so a gorgeous uh gorgeous cloudy day for us here which is a rarity Got the last uh, few details here. And as I said, I got that, uh, got the tile grouted. And still making a decision about these tiles up on top. Well, hi. 
so oh and i did a little uh patio paving action here they had some uh some of these nice uh stones on the property that they it needs a little bit of yeah I get, uh, it's settling in now after a couple of days so might do cement yeah so i gotta secure the ones on the edge here by the step but uh but this is a really important step because we need the step yeah because um well, I don't know about you guys, but one of the things we really, really miss about being in quarantine is not going out to restaurants. I really miss, we miss our restaurant so much. So the garden shed is no longer a garden shed. It is now turned into the... It has been transformed. The Quarantina. The Quarantina. Or whatever other food shack. That's right. We, it may become a, a rib joint. It, uh, it's yeah, going to be. Rib joints are coming. We've yeah. got all kinds of ideas for other things. But again, in a house full of really fun, creative people, uh, people come up with all kinds of fun ideas to, to, you know, to. Since we can't go to restaurants, we're making our own right here. So. So we wanted to show you a little bit of uh, making your restaurant at home. Here's how you do it. Got some tables. Oh, Marge's. Marge's, Marge's, and Taco Bar. Marge's, Marge's, and Taco Bar. Oh, it's so cute. I got my uh, saltish glasses and all of my accoutrements. Things. And this is our shot special. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's going to be gone. Oh, <laughs> Marge's Monday tacos. <laughs> yes. Marge's Monday Marks. <laughs> Marge's Monday Marks and Tacos. Uh, Marge's Marks are my fave. Oh, nice. Okay, oh, I'm going to yeah. give us a good have a Marge. Marge's Marge. Mar Mar Would you like a Marge? I'd like a Marge. Thanks, Marge. No, wait, I'm Marge. <laughs> Thanks, Gail. <laughs> oh, Gail. Oh, for sure. I think I would be great in the mariachi band. Oh, I think you would, too. I'm violin, I believe. You'd probably have a lot of fun, actually. I think I would. Hi. Hi. What are the options? Got a menu there. Oh, geez, look at that chicken, beef, shrimp. Uh, actually, how about a beef? You want flour or corn? Uh, and, uh, I'll just do, or do you uh, want low carb. A low carb if there's a one available. There it yes, is. please. With all the fixings. Wow, really? Can I get a margarita here? Yeah. Would you like one? Yes, I would. All right. Let me, uh, Let's get go this taco with wine. Let's go good with wine, right? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. How long have you guys been here? You know, we just opened. Yeah. Grand, grand opening today, actually. Oh, wow. Such a coincidence. I just I know. happened to be here. You're so crazy. You're just like, show right I've up. never been here before. So. All right. Thank you so much. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Margarita for you. I can't even handle this right now. <laughs> <laughs> and it's weird because it feels a little bit real. Yeah. Just like enough real that it like is like, can I get it? it works. Yes. What a lovely establishment. I know. This Marge's, is a really cool place. I forgot to. It's Marge's, Marge's, Marg's and Tacos. <laughs> Marg's, Marg's, Marg's and Tacos. Marge's, Marg's. Marge's, Marg's and Tacos. Marg's. Woo! Margarita. <laughs> Thank you. Woo -hoo! Yay! I think yeah. that there was a, a, shot, a shot. Yes, I would love a shot. Thank you so much. All my So it's pretty classic. Started out to build this garden shed, and again we've had using materials that were all here on site, and uh, found the, the trusses and all this. We basically just bought a little bit of this uh, T111 siding. Um, still got a little bit of trim paint and some more paint and details to do. Got it set up here with the uh, um, some leftover tiles that we were also had uh, from a, a neighbor. So we got that all in. Just got it grouted today though. So. Um, but our neighbor who has all those fab cool tiles gave us a bunch that we can use. And we're, right now we just got some of them set in place just to kind of get an idea of what might work where. Um, 
But the ironic thing is that uh, it just happens to be lined up like a nice little food cart almost. So <laughs> last week we did our first foray into it and uh, had our Monday evening taco night. And it happens to be Cinco de Mayo right now today. So we are going to have ourselves a little Cinco de Mayo gathering out here. And uh, got everything all set up and going to be bringing out food. We're going to be cooking up some tasty meat and chicken and some shrimp on this awesome Camp Chef grill. We've got uh, our own little outside sink here. Can't go to a restaurant, so we're just making our own. And uh, Aaron, who's making the awesome cornhole sets for everyone, also happened to put together this great little sign for us. The Quarantina. Yeah. And I'm uh, dressed for the occasion. Margaritas. Do you see that. this plate? Oh this is God. one of each. This is sh scrimps, fishes, chickens, chickens, and steak. Oh, Marge's Margs. Oh, brought to you by oh, the Quarantina. Early. Oh yeah. Oh, this sucks. <laughs> we hate our taco bar. Can I slap you with it? <laughs> Can I slap you with it? Can I have half chicken half chicken? Oh, totally. So good. Yeah. Um, 